Hello, everybody. Um, uh, welcome to this uh, second live uh, for the ECAM Engineering Program. Uh, thank you for joining us. So today we will be talking about the um, general features of the ECAM Engineering Program, the structure of the program, and we will also be talking about uh, uh, the um, admission process, uh, and uh, we will uh, also talk about the application. But first of all, we will introduce ourselves. So um, my name is Lorena Mancinelli, and I work uh, at ECAM for the uh, admission department. And if you apply, uh, we will probably be exchanging via email and telephone before your arrival uh, here at Lyon. And I am here with uh, Naham and Barthelemy, so I will give them uh, the possibility to introduce themselves. Uh, Naham. So I'm Naram El Hussein. Hello, everyone. I'm an assistant professor in electrical engineering in ECAM Lyon since October 2018. And now I'm the coordinator of the energy engineering concentration. So today I'm happy to present this concentration to you. If you have any questions, do not hesitate to ask me on the chat. And hello, my name is Barthélémy Labat. I am a third year student at ECAM Lyon Engineering. Uh, I would like to specialize my, myself in, uh, in the energy uh, specialization, and I am from Brussels. Okay, thank you very much. So, first of all, um, as I said, we will, um, I will explain you a little bit about our school, ECAM Lyon, uh, and then we will have a look at the, at the program structure. So, I will share my screen uh, with you so that you can have a... Okay, so it should be uh, working as presentation. Okay, here it is. Okay, so ECAM um, Lyon it is uh, an engineering school, and I think it is very important to say that uh, France has probably the oldest engineering tradition in uh, in Europe. In fact, mm -hmm. this tradition goes all the way back uh, to um, King Louis XIV uh, time, uh, which is also known as Louis the Great, or maybe you know him as uh, the Sun King. Um, because at this time, um, soldiers were recruited uh, to uh, accomplish specific engineering tasks. Uh, over the time, this soldier uh, would embrace uh, civil engineering projects such as uh, road or bridges constructions, uh, arbor management, and so on. Uh, and based on the need of this technological uh, development, which was constant at uh, those time, the first engineering schools were created uh, right after the, the French uh, Revolution. And the system, uh, which is called Grands Écoles, uh, saw the light. So for an international student, I think, that Grands Écoles doesn't really sound uh, familiar. So what you have to keep in mind when we um, talk about uh, Grands Écoles is that um, Grands Écoles are education institution uh, which allies excellence in teaching methods and pedagogy with a selective recruitment process. By doing so, uh, these schools uh, attracted and still attract uh, students coming uh, from all over the world. And ECAM Lyon, as you can see, is a part of this uh, Grand Zécole uh, system, and it is quite ancient school who was founded in 1900. Today, ECAM Lyon is uh, one um, is has been ranked the second best private engineering school. Uh, in France, as you can see uh, from the, the slide that I'm showing. Uh, most important are the criteria that are used to, um, to, to fulfill these, uh, these rankings, which are four. Uh, so first of all, you have the employability of young graduates, meaning how long does a student, a graduate student takes uh, to find a job uh, at the end of his studies. And for uh, ECAM Lyon, the answer is about two months. But you have also to know that 50% um, of our students uh, find a job uh, even before the end of their, of their studies. 
The second criteria is the quality of teaching and student support. Um, this criteria is evaluated directly by our students uh, to whom um, uh, we ask the question, we ask them to evaluate. Uh, so this is the second criteria that is taken into account uh, for this ranking. And then uh, there is the um, criteria uh, which take it, takes into account the ties that the school has with the industries. Uh, for ECAM Lyon, this ties is really important, very strong, um, and this is something uh, that really helps our students when they are looking for an internship and also uh, when they are uh, looking for their first job. And then the last criteria is the uh, international openness, meaning uh, which are the possibility that the school offers to the student uh, to um, do a semester or a year abroad uh, to also uh, have um, an international uh, environment uh, with professors and students coming uh, from, from all over the world. But now we will have a look, um, a closer look at the um, main feature of the ECAM engineering program. So, uh, as you might already know, it is um, an engineering program that proposes. Uh, four um, different specializations. So the energy engineering specialization um, that we will explore more in depth today, but uh, there are three more specializations, which are robotics and IT, industrial and supply chain management, and mechanical design uh, engineering. The main feature of this program is that um, it is taught 100% uh, in English, uh, so from day one till the end uh, of the studies. And uh, the specialization will start from year three and it will uh, go on uh, during year four and five with the year five, which will be spent entirely abroad uh, in a partner university, uh, which will be delivering uh, a second degree because the other uh, important feature of the program is that ECAM engineering is a, uh, a double degree program, meaning that at the end of the fifth year, students will be uh, awarded the ECAM um, engineering degree, which is a degree in mechanical and electrical engineering, plus a master of science in the chosen uh, specialization. Looking uh, closer to the uh, program structure, you can see that it is so um, uh, a three plus two uh, program. So uh, it is what we call a um, combined bachelor and master uh, program with three years of general engineering uh, program and then two years of uh, specialization. But I will ask uh, Naham to maybe tell us a little bit more about the um, the, the structure of the program and especially what it's possible to study during the first years and then uh, during the two years of uh, specialization. So in fact, during the first two years, this is the common core, core for all students where they take the fundamental courses of engineering. During the third year, there is also a common core during the first and the second semesters. However, in the second semester of the third year, students start to take some uh, concentration courses regarding their own specialization, whether it is in robotics or energy engineering or mechanical design or industrial and supply chain management. So this is the first three years program. During the fourth year, so now students already chose their own concentration. And the fifth year is abroad in a partner university. So we have many partner universities with ECAM where they can get a double degree. So a master's in science in a specific field, in a specific concentration. Mm -hmm. uh, thank you, Naham. Uh, what is important also is that during the um, uh, the entirety of the program, you will have different uh, projects and workshops on which you will be uh, working on. Uh, the aim of the project is um, mainly to learn how to design uh, a product or um, innovate a product or a process of, um, of um, construction. Uh, 
keeping in mind uh, that mm, you want to reduce the impact that your product will have on the uh, on the environment. It is the so-called eco design. So this is very important, and you will find it um, during uh, the, um, the entire uh, program in this um, uh, project that you will uh, will have to, to take. And also the workshops so are very important because um, they give you not only the possibility to discover, as Naham said, the different specialization, but they will also uh, give you a concrete experience uh, on what does it mean to be uh, an engineer. So now we will, um, I will ask a question. We'll just stop my um, uh, sharing. Okay, I hope you can see me. Yes. Okay, perfect. So, um, just maybe a question uh, to uh, Barthélemy. Um, so, you have studied abroad before coming to France, so you have quite a, an international background. So, I would like to know why you decided to, why you choose the ECAM engineering program and why you decided to study in English. Okay, so uh, I first uh, chose uh, to um, um, the ECAM engineering program because uh, uh, since um, since high school, I I really wanted to work into energy and and in particularly um, uh, in, in renewable energies. And so uh, ECAM engineering uh, uh, proposed this specialization, and uh, and also um, uh, proposed um, a deep. Um, deep studies in a, in a, in mechanical engineering which interested me also so it is all this scientific uh, knowledge with um, which uh, pushed me uh, to uh, to uh, to uh, choose the ECAM engineering program and also um so uh because i i studied a lot abroad um i was uh, uh my my uh, level of english was was uh, greater than uh, than uh, than uh, the than the average and so I, uh, I, I thought it was a good challenge, and 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 also uh, it was a real, um, a real um, um, chance uh, to to uh, to uh, to uh, to, um, to uh, study um, engineering with all courses in, in English because um, uh, it is it is very not um, it, it is very not um, usual uh, in France to to uh, to have a, such a kind of a, of, of of curriculum, so so I was really interested um, into uh, the income engineering program, and uh, also I I uh, choose uh, to uh, to um, to study in Ecam Lyon because uh, I have lived like th three years in primary school in Lyon and I really like the city, and so I I, uh, I I I wanted to to uh, discover it in new time. Okay. Thank you so much. Um, Naham, maybe you can tell us a little bit about uh, what are the advantages of studying in English? Why a student should uh, come at Tecam Lyon and study in English? Well, in fact, studying in English has a lot of advantages. So students who graduate from ACAM engineering, for example, can find jo jobs worldwide in different countries where English, for example, is the official language or the second offic official language. Moreover, uh, during the last year of ACAM engineering, uh, usually they go abroad to a partner university where they study the, the final year, so the, their second year of master's. So since they start in ACAM to learn scientific uh, theories in English and then go abroad to a partner university where they, they can integrate easily and they can follow the courses uh, there very easy since they are already used to studying in English. So in fact, studying in English has a lot of advantages and is a key for future opportunities worldwide, not only in, Fran in France, for example. Okay, yeah, that's true. And um, Barthélemy, can you tell us, um, talking about the ECAM engineering program, uh, now you are in third year, uh, so, what have you been studying during year one and two? And uh, regarding the workshop that you have done uh, to discover the different specialization, uh, what, 
What did you study? Can you tell us a little bit about uh, about that? Uh, so for all the for the different subjects uh, studied in first and second year. So uh, uh, in the first semester of the first year, uh, we uh, I, I I have studied uh, chemistry, but uh, for only one semester, and uh, then um, um, I studied uh, thermodynamics. Uh, this subject uh, uh, became um, um, the, the mechanical, um, uh, uh, sorry, uh, the the fluid mechanics um, subject uh, in a second year. Uh, also, I uh, I have studied uh, electronics, mathematics, uh, materials in a second year, um, general mechanics, uh, which which became uh, solid me mechanics in a in, in second year, um, and and also um, we um, uh, I I learned also uh, to, to 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 code and uh, particularly in a, in a C plus uh, plus and uh, and uh, yeah and uh, for for the workshops uh, so um, I so uh, for the first uh, year uh, we have uh, like one workshop. Uh, for like three months or or, or, or something, and so um, uh, I I I I really wanted to uh, to uh, discover uh, 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 to to have a real uh, broadcast understanding of uh, of of the of the different wor wor workshops uh, that that were proposed to us. So uh, so um, yeah. So 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 as you said, um, the, um, uh, th these these workshops uh, are are really. Concrete and and uh, and I really uh, enjoyed um, uh, to uh, take part to 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 a workshops projects uh, because they were very interesting and concrete. Uh, so uh, uh, we made a May sta a maze table like um, a, 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 a table which uh, we, which we improved by by ourselves uh, in a team of three. And uh, and uh, we are uh, we are produced some uh, so, some diodes on it and 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 we made it an infinity uh, an, an infinite table so 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 I I, I really enjoyed this uh, workshop we made um, a, a solar cooking um, a box uh, so so with uh, with the aluminium which uh, we, which reflects uh, the the sun's um, radiations. And raise and so uh, to 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 the cooking uh, sample. So so yeah. So uh, the workshops were very were very interesting. And also uh, last year, um, I made a workshop uh, for the industrial and supply chain uh, concentration, which I found very interesting because um, be, be, because yeah, it's um, it 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 proposed um, some some uh, economical aspects. Of uh, of engineering and uh, and uh, how to deal, um, uh, how to, how to manage an, an industry, but uh, yeah, but uh, I uh, I uh, but I still kept in, uh, in 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 my mind the idea of uh, of uh, to, uh, to 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 specialize myself into the energy uh, space specialization. Okay, thank you. So no, I will just add a small yes. thing about workshops. In fact, in uh, year two, in order to let students discover different concentrations, we give them the opportunity to choose two workshops per year. So there is one workshop in uh, January and another one in June. Each workshop belongs to a specific concentration. This way, they can try two workshops in two different concentrations. And in the third year, they can choose their final concentration in which they want to specialize. Mm -hmm. So, uh, and there is also another option, instead of choosing a workshop, they can choose also a winter school. So we have some winter schools with partner universities. Last year, for example, uh, several students went to some partner universities in Thailand where they followed courses on a specific concentration, for example, in energy, they followed a lot of courses related to sustainability and energy efficiency, climate change, for, for example. And they also uh, went to different technical visits in Thailand in order to get an idea on how the energy situation uh, goes in a foreign country like Thailand. So uh, they have a lot of opportunities, either workshops in ACAM in Lyon or go to a winter school abroad.
So this is also a very advantageous uh, opportunity. Yes. Um, thank you very much for this uh, complement of information. And now <clears throat> we will talk a little bit uh, more in detail about the energy engineering concentration. So Naham, as, can you please uh, tell us what does it mean to study within this concentration? Uh, what are the projects and workshops the students can work on? And also, uh, which are the career opportunities that they will have once they graduate with this uh, specialization? Okay, so in fact, energy engineering is a mix of electrical and mechanical engineering. So, for example, in electrical engineering, uh, students follow courses related to power systems, to energy storage systems, to renewable energy, to the design of electrical machines. In addition, they follow also courses related to the mechanical engineering. So like, uh, for example, thermodynamics of thermal machines uh, and energy storage systems, heat transfer and mechanical and electrical uh, systems, numerical modeling of fluid flows. So the aim, in fact, of this concentration is to be able to develop and design systems that are that have a high energy efficiency while reducing the energy cost. So moreover, students, thanks to this concentration, will be able to analyze the effects of energy facilities to the local environment, for example, and to the economy. So there are a lot of learning outcomes, like designing, for example, renewable uh, energy facilities and optimize the related, the related uh, model, uh, supply chain and management of, of such systems, uh, reducing energy costs, as I, as I said before. At the end, when students graduate with a master's in mechanical and electrical engineering, with a concentration in energy engineering, there are a lot of career opportunities, such as, for example, an energy efficiency engineer that usually uh, takes into account reducing uh, the costs of energy in a specific system and developing energy facilities that are not harmful for the environment and that are sustainable. Moreover, they can work in the research field in energy in order to develop new uh, new facilities, in order to design renewable energy sources that are not harmful for the environment. And also they can work as an energy system engineer in order to uh, in order to be able to work in the industrial department and the supply chain management of such systems. Okay, perfect. This gives a much better idea of what is possible to do uh, when you specialize in uh, energy engineering. And so, Bartolomé, you told us a little bit why you decided to specialize in this, this field. Um, do you have an idea now that Naham explained us uh, what is possible to do with the specialization? Today, do you have already an idea of what you would like to do uh, once you graduate, it might change. We know that projects can change. But what is your idea today? Well, uh, since, since high school, I always wanted to uh, work into renewable energies because uh, uh, I found this uh, domain uh, very, uh, very attractive, and um, and uh, and and also it is a uh, very actual issues, uh, uh, very um, um, like like it it is one of the biggest issues that uh that our that, that our world nowadays uh wants to uh, to um to um to face so so uh, so so i i i was always uh, fa fascinated uh, uh, about creating um or on or, or or innovating uh, in a in a such new uh, kind of energies of, of green e energies mm -hmm. so so uh, so so so, uh, so. I, I came to a camp engineering. Uh, I, uh, I, um, I, uh, I, I always kept in mind uh, this will of 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 um, specializing myself into the energy con concentration and and uh, and and, and uh, to uh, to um, to have um, uh, uh, concrete ideas of uh, what are renewable energies 
and uh, and uh, and uh, how to to uh, yeah to uh, improve the the energy efficiency because uh, yeah because uh, uh, it is because uh, uh, the fossil energies uh, are um, are very limited nowadays and so we are really have to find uh, some solutions for it so renewable energies are a solution and so 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 I think it is a very good um, a domain to, to, mm -hmm. to, to work in. Yes, and for your internship, because you will be uh, doing uh, your second internship now at the end of your third year, do you have um, an idea? Do you have more or less uh, the company where you would like to do your internship? Well, uh, I, do, I do not have a real idea of the company in, in which I want uh, in. In, in which I want to do my uh, my second internship, but I really want to um, to, uh, to 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 make an, an internship uh, w w which is related to uh, to uh, renewable energies uh, and and uh, and in energy in general because uh, my first uh, internship was in um, in, um, in, um, in 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 a renewable plastic uh, firm. Mm -hmm. Or, or, or fabric, and so it was really interesting. But uh, I, but but it it wasn't that much uh, into the energy domain, and, and and so now I am very, um, uh, so I am very motivated uh, to to uh, to uh, to uh, to to work in, in an internship, or uh, to to be to be an in, in sorry to be an internship uh, in 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 a company which deals with uh, green. Uh, and, and renewable energies. Mm -hmm. Okay, perfect. Um, Naham, do you have any maybe suggestion of uh, where the student could do the, um, the internship? What it could be uh, in Lyon or maybe abroad, which are the uh, firms and industry that are linked to ECAM uh, for the energy engineering um, specialization? So, in fact, now we are in a world aiming for the energy transition. And this concentration relies on that. Uh, there are a lot of companies working towards the energy transition in order to enhance the energy efficiency, for example. So, uh, in France, there are a lot of companies working on renewable energy, such as wind turbines and hydraulics and, uh, and photovoltaics, too. And abroad, this is also an advantage of ECAM engineering students since they, they learned in English the engineering courses. They can easily find abroad an internship in Europe or worldwide uh, that belongs to the same field of energy. And uh, also in the engineering program, uh, they, uh, they have courses on energy is issues and practices around the world, not only in France. So this facilitates their um, their internship abroad, and also they uh, they get a lot of theories about recycling, for example, of equipment and the and the importance of that. So they really have a lot of op opportunities in several uh, companies in France and abroad. Since this is the trend nowadays for energy transition. Mm -hmm. Yes. So I don't know if there is any question regarding the specialization. I will have a look, uh, not for the moment, but so to all the students that are um, watching the, the video, if you have any question really regarding the specialization, we have Naham, who is uh, the, the program leader for the specialization. So really do not hesitate. She, she can really answer. Um, no, I should add something. Yes. Uh, I should add something about the uh, learning approach mm -hmm. uh, in a Cam Lyon. It's a learning approach based on projects. So we try to encourage students to design a system and then to make a prototype uh, by using workshops, for, for example, by using multidisciplinary projects. So this is a main advantage of our engineering program since we focus on the project-based learning approach in order to enhance their engineering analysis uh, skills and uh, to develop such, uh, such skills in our engineers. 
Yeah, so it is one of the main feature of the the ECAM um, approach on teaching is really to give the students the possibility to uh, be concrete in their in their studies. Of course, you will have um, uh, courses where you will you will learn mathematics, physics, but together with that, you will have also um, a hands-on approach on different type of uh, projects and uh, and workshops. So let me check if there is any question regarding the specialization. Not yet. So um, I will move on to uh, another subject which might interest uh, the international students. So I will ex briefly explain the application process. But if you want to um, ask a question, uh, please go ahead. So then we, I will come back on the, on the question. I will again uh, share my screen just to um show you where you can find all the information about the um the application process Um, I don't know if I hear an echo, so I don't know if I'm still, if you can still hear me. We can hear you. Yes, okay. yes, can. Perfect. Okay, so I had a little problem because I was hearing myself. So again, I will share my screen. Sorry. Okay. Um, so here you can look at the... Um, You, you can have a look at the, where you can find the information about the uh, application process. So you, when you are on the website, you can just go on uh, academic programs, then you uh, choose engineering. Once you are uh, in the, the main page, you can go to admission, and then you will find um, the application process. You can have a look if you want at the video that we have realized uh, where we explain in a quite funny way uh, the different steps of the application process. But just to um, sum up, uh, there will be four steps for the uh, one you, once you decide to apply. So, uh, first of all, you have to uh, enroll on the uh, online uh, admission portal. So once you click here, you can have a look and uh, you will just arrive on this page. And if you are a new applicant, you uh, just click on applicant. Then you will create your um, your uh, application form. There will be a few questions uh, you can answer. There will be required documents. So you can also have information about the needed documents here. You have requested documents. Once your application is completed, you will be invited to um, an online um, interview and scientific test. Uh, so scientific test is on mathematics and physics. So if you want to have uh, an idea of which are the topics that will be asked, uh, you have them here on the, on the page. Uh, if you pass, then you will uh, undergo uh, the um, admission panel. So we have uh, on a monthly basis, starting from January, uh, we have um, the admission boards. And um, if you pass, okay, if you are uh, an eligible student, then the uh, last step it will be the English test. So to be um, uh, enrolled, you need to have a minimum B2 uh, level. And uh, either you uh, send us a copy of the valid certificate, or you can pass um, a test line. If everything is fine, then you will uh, receive uh, an admission proposition, and then it will be uh, up to you to accept uh, the uh, admission. 
We will accompany you throughout the, uh, the, the entire process. So we will be there also for the visa. Uh, we will help you out find accommodation on campus if you wish to stay on campus. And there is a specific service, um, a welcome desk, that will get in touch once you are uh, an enrolled student and will give you all the, the information about the your, before your arrival uh, on, uh, on campus. Uh, and there will be a specific um, live also dedicated to the, um, to the uh, bureaucracy, let's say, once you, uh, once you arrive. Um, if you wish, uh, there will be, uh, you can have a look at the campus and have a um, virtual visit of our campus. So you can just uh, come back to the first page of um, the ECAN website. And then you have uh, the virtual visit. You just click on it. And you will have a look of um, campus. So if you turn around, you can have a look about on the city of Lyon. You can see that uh, ECAN Lyon campus is really in the city center. So we are very close um, to the city, but still on a, let's say, privileged area on this green hill far away from traffic and so if you want to explore a little bit our country you just have to click on the on the flash and then you will be inside the building and the buildings you can have a look you can have video you can have some information about uh, what is done in uh, in the building what is um, are the laboratories that you can find in the in the building and you can just have a look i know it's not the same as coming but at least will give you uh, an idea uh, about um about our school um since we still have some time maybe we can have um, a small chat with uh Lenny and Naham about the about life in Lyon. Uh, what does it mean to be a student in Lyon uh, for Barthélemy and also maybe Naham, since you are not originally from Lyon, uh, what is your impression about, uh, about this, uh, this city? So maybe uh, Barthélemy can tell us something about your experience in uh, Lyon. Well, so um, I just knew a very little bit uh, Lyon uh, be before coming to ECAM because, um, so as I say, I, I lived uh, three years in Lyon when I was in, prim in primary school. Uh, and so I just had uh, very good me 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 memories of the city. And uh, now uh, I'm really not di dis disappointed because I, I, I really find this city very beautiful. And, and uh, so uh, uh, I uh, um, like, um, so, uh, um, so I am a musician. And um, I think is a very uh, artistic um, city. Like uh, there, the, there are always ma many concerts, theaters, um, and uh, and uh, and pubs, and uh, and uh, and there are always some places, some be some beautiful places, some parks, some uh, with with Belcourt or or Tiro. Uh, so so it is a very beautiful city and. Uh, and there are always uh, things to do uh, when uh, when go when going up, and uh, and yeah, and so and so I'm really not disappointed uh, about go, going to to uh, to Ican Lyon because uh, uh, so uh, for because the 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 school is uh, is is very nice and and the city is uh, is very attractive so so it's yeah it's really cool. Okay, thank you. And uh, Naham, can you tell us a little bit also about your experience here in uh, in Lyon? So the advantage in Lyon is uh, that there are a lot of international students. It is known as a, a city where a lot of students come here, and uh, there is, there is a lot of help for international students especially in the administrative uh, processes. 
So I know that in ICAM there is a service for that for international students, but also in the region of Lyon, there is a students welcome desk, for example, that helps students that are who arrive to Lyon and uh, help them to finish their uh, administrative paper, for example. So this is a main advantage of uh, of Lyon since we come here, for example, we know no one. So there's also there's always a help from uh, from people here. Moreover, uh, Lyon is, uh, is not far from Paris, the big city, and is also not far from uh, the villages like the villages and the Alps. For, so for those who love, for example, to ski, the Alps is next to Lyon, it's two hours from here. And also for the ones who, for example, in summer like to go to the south, it's also possible from Lyon. So uh, the location of the city is also very interesting in order to visit several things, uh, several cities in, in Europe and in France especially. Uh, I should add also that uh, Lyon is a city, but it's also calm. So uh, for the students, it's the, it is the best compromise between the big city and the, the village. Yes, and also what is important is that uh, Lyon is um, a very rich uh, region. Lyon and Rhône-Alpes is a very rich region. Um, because many international firms and companies are based uh, in Lyon. So this makes it very much easier for an engineer student to find an internship, to find the first job, because the region offers uh, a lot. Uh, especially that uh, excuse yes, yes, especially yes. that in the region they are uh, there's a, a government like a, an official decision in order to make the region more uh, eco-friendly so uh, this is uh, this focuses on the energy concentration in fact so uh, so there are a lot of things that we can teach in ACAM and then show them to the students how they apply this in the region where they live. So this is an advantage for uh, for our concentration in the region. Yes, yes, it is. Um, I just saw a question regarding the um, internship. Uh, so when during the year do we participate in the third year internship? Um, so it is at the end of the year. Uh, it you will be finishing, uh, if I'm not wrong, in June, the classes. Uh, am I right, Bartolomé? Yes, you fin will yes, be finishing yes, in June. Uh, uh, well, we, we, are, we are planned to, 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 uh, to end the courses uh, at uh, the end of May. Okay. In, in, a, in a third year. So, so, so the internship is three months for, for, for the third year. Uh, it is uh, uh, so June, uh, July and August. Okay, so yes, normally you you use the summer uh, months to do the internship, and then you start uh, straight away uh, your fourth uh, fourth year. Uh, maybe Bartolomé, you can tell us a little bit something about uh, the um, uh, student life at ECAM. Uh, I know that you are part of the music club, so yeah. just to give us uh, an idea of what it. What does it mean to be a student at ECAM outside uh, the, the classroom? Yeah, so what is very nice at, at ECAM is that uh, there is uh, not only the, the classes, the, the courses that we have to follow, the, uh, there are also many uh, clubs and associations. Uh, so so uh, there, are, there are lots like uh, for, 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 for sportive uh, clubs uh, and activities. Uh, there are uh, like climbing, badminton, uh, football, rugby, uh, and uh, and many others, uh, and and um, and still um, um, many clubs are are, are being cr created uh, each year, and uh, and um, and um, and if you have a, uh, an idea of a club to be created, uh, you you can ask the administration, and and uh, and, uh, and and then you you you, you can just. Uh, Launched the uh, the project, um, so there are uh, so other than sportive clubs, there are also uh, so so I am part of the mu of of the music club. I am the communication uh, responsible, um, but uh, there are 
there are also um, like the um, the the club for tasting wine, um, the club for 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 aero for for uh, for aerodynamics, uh, for mechanics, for for robotics. If if you're really um, into one domain, in, into one specific domain, um, yeah. So 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 it is very um, uh, it is a very good thing that that uh, ECAM uh, has a uh, such um, a lot of of uh, different clubs and associations so yeah and uh so uh, if you want i can tell you a bit about the music club because mm -hmm. i know it be better than others so for the music club so if uh, one of you uh, is uh, into music uh so you are welcome at at, at ICAM because there are many um many um many um um, like so, so there is a music room at ECAM with uh, with uh, different instruments in it, which are free uh, to use, uh, and uh, there is just a small uh, 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 regulation, uh, and uh, and uh, and uh, and you have to ask to 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 go to 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 the room, but 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 there is. A uh, very good atmosphere in in, uh, in uh, this club, and and uh, so so uh, and 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 normally, so not now uh, be, be because of the sanitary uh, condition, but uh, there are, there are many jam sessions. So a jam session is uh, when the music we are we are free to use uh, for 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 any for any ECAM students, uh, and 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 so we are uh, um, so these um, these uh, instruments are. Um, are available uh, 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 either at the at the barricam, so in inside. Uh, so so, uh, so it is um, in in the case of indoor um, jam, uh, but but also outside. Uh, so so at so at at the garden. So which is uh, at the top of the Fourvia mountain uh, and just near the cafeteria. So so yeah. So. So for so if you are um, um, a musician, uh, it can is, uh, um, uh, has uh, many services to to um, to uh, propose you, and and also for sports and uh, and and for 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 many other activities. Mm -hmm. Yes, and at the moment there is no um, there is not a club linked to the energy engineering uh, that you know or. Uh, for energy engineering, um, for uh, in particularly in, uh, in energy, I do not think. But uh, but uh, if you want to uh, if you want to launch um, um, uh, 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 a, spe a specific energy club, it is uh, very possible, and uh, and uh, and uh, anyone can uh, can uh, can uh, propose an idea, and uh, yeah, and and uh, yeah. So 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 it so it is a uh, um possible to to uh, to, uh, to create uh, any kind of club yes to start a new club if you have an idea of something that you would like to to implement that doesn't exist you 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 can of course if you have a um a nice project to present um so we are almost at the end so i just would like um before uh, I asking you a, a very last question to Naham and uh, Dan Barthelemy, I just would like to remind um, the people that are watching, the students, that there will be other uh, live uh, in which we will present the, um, the other specialization. So next, next week on Tuesday at the um, same time, uh, 6.30, we will be presenting the specialization in uh, robotics and IT. And then we will be back in January. Uh, so we will present on January 12 the industrial and supply chain management uh, specialization. And then on January 20, uh, the, last, uh, the last specialization, the one in mechanical uh, engineering design. And then, as I already said, we will have um, a live with uh, our, my colleague Michael, who is in charge of uh, welcoming the international students. So we will give you all the information about the visa procedure, how to find accommodation in Lyon, what you have to do once you arrive in France, and so on. Um, so I don't see any other question in the chat. So just one last question, the same for both of you. 
So why um, you would like to recommend to an international student uh, to come to study at ECAM and uh, in the specific why choosing the uh, energy engineering um, specialization? So maybe Naham first and then Bartelemy. So uh, actually now we're in a world aiming for the energy transition. That's why the energy concentration is very beneficial in order to uh, be a part of this energy transition and in, in order to help to design more efficient systems, more uh, eco-friendly system, energy systems, starting from the production of the, uh, of the energy till its distribution while taking into account uh, all uh, issues regarding the recycling, for example, of equipment and the st sustainability of systems. Uh, moreover, learning in English is very beneficial. So uh, in order to get opportunities worldwide and uh, to be able to uh, work in, a, in any country that we, uh, that we want. And uh, the advantage of ECAM is also our uh, good relations with the companies. So for example, in ECAM, uh, sometimes we organize a one journey of challenges, challenges between students where companies come to ICAM and uh, propose some innovative projects where students work in groups and try to uh, do the, the best project. And at the end, one group uh, wins the challenge. So this is also very, uh, very beneficial because students work on practical projects that are offered by companies. So this is also an advantage of ECAM. Uh, another one is our uh, partnership with foreign universities. So at the end, students will get uh, two diploma, one from uh, ECAM Lyon and another one from a foreign university in the specific uh, concentration. Okay, thank you very much. And Barthelemy, also the same question, why um, you would recommend uh, the ECAM engineering program to uh, an international student? Well, as Naham said, uh, for, for the energy co concentration, so uh, our, ge uh, our generation uh, of, of uh, students uh, re really has to face um, um, an energy transition. We are, we are, we are can't um, continue to, 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 to always uh, Use um, the 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 fossil resources, the fossil energies, because they are very much and uh, and they um, and they are uh, much more li limited than than they were before. So we really have to find new new ways to to create energy and uh, and uh, and to optimize the energy efficiency. So um, I think it is uh, uh, the uh, the greatest issue nowadays. And uh, we really have to find some, some some solutions to it. So, if you want to to to, uh, to participate to um, um, to to, uh, to this um, research of of the solution, uh, come come to to uh, to the energy concentration. And um, yeah, so why going to to Ecam Lyon? Because uh, as we said, um, Lyon is a very nice city. It is very attractive, and particularly for students, there are many students. Uh, we, 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 uh, which are f foreigners, which which come to uh, to uh, to uh, Lyon for for studies, uh, the, um, it is uh, one of the best city uh, for uh, for for students. Like uh, all all the things we have to do there, uh, the, 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 there are there are many activities proposed um, uh, in 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 Ecam, but also uh, in Lyon. In general, um, and uh, and uh, and um, it is uh, very near uh, to to uh, to uh, mountains for for skiing and and uh, to uh, to uh, the south uh, for 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 the summer. So uh, it is uh, one one of the best city uh, for 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 studying there and uh, and um, and uh, also uh, at 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 Ikam, I think there is a very good atmosphere. Like um, so in Ikam in engineering. Uh, it is not like um, um, uh, how can I say that in English? Uh, the, the, 
like there is not a competition spirit. Mm -hmm. It is really uh, uh, like uh, we we are all helping e each other, and 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 no one is left behind. Uh, like we uh, we 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 so, like all the students in in the promotion uh, have have the will to succeed and and to help the 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 others. So so I really found this this uh, this atmosphere very. Uh, very good, very grateful for 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 students which uh, which uh, which may have some some difficulties in some sub in, in some subjects. Um, I, I um, yeah. So the ECAM spirit is 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 a very good one for for working and, and helping, and also uh, like you have many associations and clubs. So so instead of only working, uh, you 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 are can also. Uh, um, um, may, um uh, pro, uh, pro, uh, practice your your hobby if it is a sport or music like me or or uh, anything else so so a community is a very good city and 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 also the thing that um the the fact that all the courses are in english is really an, an an advantage and and you do not have to be careful to 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 have all the courses in, in english it is a very um a, a great great experience and and uh, and uh, you can benefit of it very uh, uh, effectively i think okay thank you very much uh, for um, your sharing with us your experience thank you naham for explaining us uh, more in details the energy engineering um, specialization so we will um, uh, end the, the live now so if you watch it uh, after and then you would like to send us your question, you can write at uh, admission.engineering uh, at ecam.fr. So the admission um, staff will answer you or if there is any specific question on the specialization, we can um, transfer the email to Naham, which will be uh, who will be able to to answer you and give you all the information that you that you need i hope it was useful uh, for you to know a little bit more about our school and we really hope hope uh, to see you maybe uh once um once we, it will be possible on campus uh thank you very much and uh, have a good uh, good evening thank you thank, thank you, you. bye bye